All right, what's going on, y'all? Um, I'm back with part two of the uh, the Revo video. Sadly, I went home that night that I finished that last clip on the first part. So my mechanic ended up finishing everything, even though he said he wasn't, but it is what it is. So I'm just gonna continue on with what happened the next day. I had to get my truck inspected. So we're just gonna roll that clip here. All right, y'all, so we failed an inspection. Let's just check out this clean motor right here real quick. Look at that turbo. Ooh, wee. Ooh, she looking nice. Looking nice. She screams, I'll tell you what. All right, well, let's get into this failed inspection. So I went to Kenworth, and this is what happened. So I'm going to put this up here like this for y'all. So they completed the DMT inspection and found that the windshield washer fluid does not work. That's my fault. The damn fluid didn't, the fluid wasn't filled. The rear brakes were out of adjustment. Yes, they were. Could not find the triangles. Triangles are literally, I'll show you guys. Oh, that's locked. I will literally show you. The triangles are right there. Why? Because this lock, I need to replace it. Not a big deal. The horn, right there. They, the old owner wired that, not me, so don't look at me. <laughs> but other, literally other than that, it says driver just needs to show triangles. The city horn didn't work and the lock compartment was broken off. They did not want to break it off completely. And the brake shroud adjustment. So I bought two new adjusted brake chambers and we shouldn't have any issues. Boom, right there. All that, literally cleanest truck you could ever do an inspection on, and that's what they find. But it is what it is. We got the thing taken care of, and uh, yeah, um, that's basically it. Just wanted to give you guys a little walk around the truck. Ooh. We got a 13 speed, we got a boss steering wheel. That gauge over there, the parameter, pyrometer gauge doesn't work. Got to replace these, this dash is screwed. I got to get a whole new skeleton and replace all that. This, some guy gave me a free Peterbilt seat, that's pretty cool. This came out of like a 2015, 16 Peterbilt. There's the back, I just cleaned out everything under the sleeper. I'll, I guess I'll just show you guys. It's clean as a whistle. <clears throat> Hold on, where's the flash? Literally cleaned everything out. There was some stuff spilled that might look wet, but I tried to clean as best as I could. I'm gonna steam clean it and wipe it down and clean that up. Got my fire extinguisher, just a spare one, vacuum cleaner. I'm still cleaning all the stuff up. This thing, gotta throw these nasty matches away. <sighs> gonna put new speakers, all that jazz. Came with a TV, but I don't want this old dinky thing. Doesn't obviously doesn't have an inverter, but there will be one. But yeah, there it is. I gotta put the top panel back on. So there it is. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this short video. Um, subscribe down below, comment, let me know what you think of my truck, and uh, let's get this money. <laughs>